Nardo here covering one of FaZe's favorite strats in Mirage where they rush B and smoke off get right and get left. If you watch any of FaZe's Mirage demos, you'll see this strat run at least once. This strat is based off spawns so at the beginning of the round whoever has the last two spawns will smoke get right and get left. The other three players will rush B. Rain kills Chris J peeking balcony, then Nico finds Kerrigan under window. FaZe, Plant, and Mouse are forced into 3v5 after Plant. All three CTs we take from Market and Rain is playing behind the door smoke. Mouse chooses to go through the smoke and go one for one. Then Olaf with an off angle from sight picks off another and Rops trades. And Guardian in the meantime is posted up waiting for Rops in which he secures the final kill. Let's look at FaZe's POVs where I'll go in more detail. Nico has the best spawn. He's gonna molly underpass stairs. I think the reasoning is because Mouse has a force buy and could push underpass. I've watched FaZe run the strat multiple times and usually they don't molly stairs. Anyways, as the entry fragger, you do need to throw these two flashes that will blind anyone playing under the window. Usually the first player will jump out the window and clear close and swing the e-box. However, here in this clip, Rain kills Chris J balcony and Nico decides to go out balcony and kill Kerrigan under window. Afterwards, he smokes Cat and then picks up another smoke and smokes window being careful as the get right smokes fade. When they fade, he goes and clears the area and then stays on Cat and watches it. I'm gonna skip to the next POV cause nothing else interesting happens. Rain is the second player and he'll be flashing over as he rushes. He should have bought two flashes. You don't need a nade. Another role for being the second person is mollying Van. For the pathing for the second person, it's up to you. I've seen FaZe send the second person out window or out balcony. But ideally, I think the second person should jump out window alongside the entry. This person needs to trade out the entry fragger and help clear sight. Rain gets the kill into Chris J balcony and swing out that way. He goes towards bench, however he needs to be careful crossing due to market not being smoked. Rain advances to door to play behind the smoke and gets the kill into frozen, however Rops trades him out. Olaf has the third spawn and bomb. I've seen FaZe have the second player with bomb before as well with this strat. Anyways, he should have bombed flashes. So as the third spawn you're rushing, however you're flashing over the roof while you rush. And then your job is to smoke out the molly if the CTs throw one. Ideally you want the third person to come out balcony. Olaf is going to grenade behind the smokes. In my opinion, don't throw a grenade behind the get right smokes if you're still trying to clear sight. It's better to gun out. He tries peeking Kerrigan below window, however Nico gets the kill and then Olaf jumps out window and plants default. He too is careful about the get right smokes fading. Nico's gonna take control of Cat and Olaf repositions and resmokes door, and then holds an off angle which he kills Waxic, however Rops trades. Neo had the fourth spawn and will smoke get right. In order to do so, he positions himself in the right plank and he's gonna aim right here and jump throw. Afterwards, he will rush apartments in order to flash for his teammates going out. Then he mollies empty pillar and goes kitchen to watch big flank. If his teammates had a hard time getting sight control, then Neo wouldn't turn around to watch flank and would come out and help take control. I'm gonna skip on to the next player's POV because nothing interesting else happens. Garden is the opera and has the worst spawn. When you're doing this strat, you don't want your opera as one of your first three players as those players are going out and it's harder to trade jumping out with an op or swinging balcony. You want the opera as the fourth or fifth player from spawn so that opera can stay in apartments watching market window for the cross or short when the smoke fades. Guardian will smoke at left. To throw this smoke he hugs the left wood wall and aims right here and jump throws. Then he's gonna go back in apartments and flash twice. Afterwards he posts up on market window to catch any CT trying to cross the door. Nico smokes window which is a mistake because Guardian has a free kill as long as the enemy doesn't use any utility. So with the smoke up, Guardian checks cat. He doesn't see anyone and repositions to watch door, however that gets smoked off. He tries to molly behind the smoke but fails and watches the window jump out. He spams the smoke a couple of times and then he will reposition himself to kill Rops. To wrap up, FaZe loves this strat. Although I show an older lineup executing this, they still incorporate it with all their other lineups since. FaZe uses this strat anywhere from gun rounds, anti-ecos, half by ecos. You'll see this strat at least once a match. If you're going to be doing this strat, I want to point out a couple of things. First, 
Make sure you land the smokes correctly because if you don't, a gap in one of the smokes can cost you the round. Next, if your team is copying this strat, you don't have to copy the same pathing or nades. If something works better, then make a change to it. If you liked the video, please upload and subscribe. Till next time, not out here, peace.